Intercepting the ram is a defense against an attempted tackle from the front. Um, if you've seen the technique um, in the original Ed Parker system, you'll notice that I've altered it slightly uh, with a little inspiration from Jeff Speakman and some other uh, ideas. Uh, and I've mainly taked out, uh, removed the, the hop or the leap uh, with the knee to the groin, and I've also incorporated enough the circle idea uh, to keep the opponent off balance so that you really do prevent the tackle. Let's take a look. Let's try that from one other angle. So, what's happening here? Again, just like thrusting knee, the opponent's rushing in with that tackle and I'm gouging his eyes if possible, keeping my elbows tucked, sticking my butt out. Um, but he's still trying. Maybe he's going after my legs or my body or something. So what I need to do is pull him up the circle to toss him off balance. And I'm going to drive that knee into the groin just like before. But let's say I lose my momentum. So instead of driving a knee and stepping in with an elbow, I drive that knee and he's not moving back. So I'm going to step back just the way I came, back into a left neutral bow with a left downward elbow to the center of his spine. Now there's a good chance he might be reaching for my leg or trying to hit me in the groin, so I need to step back quickly again with a right inward downward uh, elbow through the face or the temple, and then I can do a right rear scoop through the face as I cover out. Let's do that again from the other side with a little explanation. Um, uh, actually, attack me from 12, from the camera's perspective. So, I'm stopping with eye gouges, tucking those elbows. He's fighting me still a little bit. I'm going to go up the circle to sort of talk, pull him off balance a little bit. Uh, maybe his hands would go to the floor because I'm pulling him. He may uh, let go and try to brace his fall. I'm going to drive the knee into the solar plexus. Notice I was in a left neutral. Driving the knee into the solar plexus, stepping back into a left neutral with that left downward elbow. I'm going to step back with the right horizontal or inward downward elbow through the head. And then I can pivot away to a close kneel with a scoop into the face as I cover out. So, there you have it for intercepting the ramp.